Hey everybody, good morning. Uh, we're taking a look at uh, chapter uh, 31 in 1 Samuel. Happens to be the last chapter of 1 Samuel. And we see here um, how King Saul and his two sons uh, have died in battle. And, and also the king's armor bearer. And I think this is, is, a, is a way that the Lord decided to close out uh, the book of 1 Samuel is with the first king of Israel. Um, dying and and dying in battle against his enemy, dying against the Philistines, and you know I'm reminded of the words uh, that uh, um, Samuel, when uh, Saul consulted a medium, and brought the spirit of Samuel, and I, I'm reminded of the words that he said. It was in uh, chapter 28, verse 19. It says, "Moreover, the Lord will also deliver Israel." with you into the hand of the Philistines, and tomorrow you and your sons will be with me. The Lord will also deliver the army of Israel into the hand of the Philistines. And So here it is, Saul knew the day before that uh, um, he was going to die. And you know what? There's nothing he could have done to stop that. You know, that that I see here. There's nothing that he could have done. Um, so he went about in his battle. And maybe he didn't believe Samuel. I don't know. I mean, he believed Samuel and all his other stuff, so I don't know. Um, but, but you see, Samuel went ahead and told him ahead of time that this was going to happen. And, and, and Saul continued. He, 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 from what we see here, we don't see that there was any repentance. We don't see that there was any, any other going to God in any way. And, and of course, it, it happened just as Samuel said. I mean, he died the very next day. And this is a tragic end. And, you know, we'll pick it up tomorrow and... Second Samuel will be a cool study. So I hope you guys have a super, super day. I love you all.